welcome to Black Ops 3. It's NDWA here. And, um, it's been a while since I recorded this. Or, yeah, last recorded it. Because, um, I've only been doing some other work that I'm actually thinking about recording also. And I've also been busy with the Kingdom Hearts series, which I'm starting to see that everybody's still enjoying. And I'm glad that you're enjoying it, and I hope you enjoy all the future content. Now, before the... Well, no, the game's gonna start anyways. I was gonna say, before the game starts, I would like to see some ideas about what I should do for Halloween. But then, I did some brainstorming before I started recording, and I came with Claire. Now, if anybody who was around back in the early day of my of YouTube, or my channel anyways, I broadcasted Claire a while, black, a while back. Not black, but a while back. And... What I did was, I was showing off some gameplay because it was free and I never played it before, so I just decided to stream it on my channel. Now, what I'm thinking about doing is doing the same thing except instead of just like doing halfway, not knowing where to go, and then just give up, what I'm gonna do is a, a full playthrough on my Twitch. Now, I managed to fix my Twitch settings because for some reason it wasn't saving my broadcast. Now that I actually hit fixed it, it's saving broadcast now. Or streams, I guess you could call them. They're broadcasts on PlayStation. But what I'm gonna try doing is more streams on there. Because that's a nice way to expand a little bit. Now I know you're probably thinking, why would you Go over there to stream if you're trying to grow your channel. Because people enjoy some, not all, but some of my content. And I know that you're going to probably want to see more of it. So that's why I'm deciding to do streaming and on Twitch. Also, what I'm going to try doing is the boss fight on Critical on Kingdom Hearts 2. Now the reason why I was so hesitant to say that is because I, I beat the game. I've, I've beaten it on Critical before. The final boss is not fun. Anybody who's played it Uncritical knows the pain because you gotta know his moves, you gotta learn them, you gotta button mash at the end. It's it's a pain. It's a real pain. And critical just makes it worse because critical you don't get that much health. You get level one health. You don't want level one health. You want like level ninety nine health. Well, that's only possible if I do critical, or not critical, but uh, proud, standard, or beginner. Which I'm probably going to do if I decide to record the Kingdom Hearts 2 series after my Kingdom Hearts 1. Now, there's going to be a gap between the two, and it's called Chains of Memories. It is obviously, do the Kingdom Hearts 2 series, beginner, or standard, or proud. I want you guys to let me know in the comments which mode you want to see. I will probably get some footage if I don't end up deleting any by accident because PlayStation storage is such a pain. If I can try to get some stuff done. Now what I'm gonna do after okay, so back to back to basically what I was saying about chain of memories. Chain of memories is the in-between of one and two. It explains how Sora knows a certain somebody in Kingdom Hearts 2. Very plot relevant. Um, 
it explains where the organization comes from. Again, very plot relevant. And basically, that whole Shazam right there is kind of plot relevant for three. But that's why I'm going to record it because I want you guys to see for yourselves rather than me just give you a short and simple summary. Anyways, if if you think that I should probably do like four of the games, I think that's one and two, one point five and two point five. My chain of memories, first one, second one, Breath by Sleep. Yeah, four games. If you want to see four gameplay series, I will, of course, I will get that out when I can. Now these are not easy games. Chains of Memories is a pain for me. Birth by Sleep is three different stories and the second one is just I don't know, second one's weird. Combat's, combat's weird but I like it. Um, so yeah if you want to see those let me know. Also I was thinking about Recording Sonic Forces. Now, yes, they're going to block cutscenes in the game. However, that saves me the copyright claims in case I do not decide to do a voiceover. Which I'm going to highly doubt you're going to want to hear a voiceover. Because it's just going to be me being awkward on the mic the entire time. So, I'm going to probably do that. If you want to see Sonic Mania, let me know also. Because Sonic, I haven't beaten Sonic Mania yet, and I know what you're going to. Pro I know you, what you're probably thinking. I know what you're probably thinking. Why have you not beat Sonic Mania yet? It is easy. It's simplistic. Here's the thing. I'm stuck on Metal Sonic, and this is just on Sonic Solo, because I still cannot get used to the part where he turns into a giant with the infinite stone. Well, not the infinite stone, but the uh, phantom ruby. I cannot get pe I cannot get used to that. So, what I just I, every time he turns into a giant, I end up slipping and then he crushes me. Almost every time guaranteed. So, which is why I am going to try to come over it to overcome it if I can not if I can you know actually learn to not stand back and let him crush me because I know that the chest piece is very important but what else I'm what else I'm gonna do is like I'm probably gonna do more doom snap maps now, the reason why I'm saying I'm doing more Doom snap maps is because I did a Resident Evil kind of fan made map from Doom snap map. And it was supposed to be a scene from the movie where they were in the laser room trying to get to the Red Queen, except everybody got cut in half. Not really half, but diced by lasers. And so what I was. What I did a video on it, and it was it was a good video. I, li I liked playing the game. I, well, I enjoyed Doom all around, but I, I mean, I enjoyed the map. The creator of that map did an amazing job. Now, let me get some breath in here. Aside, <coughs> aside from that, um, what was another thing I was going to try saying? Ah, uh, for Halloween... I know I said earlier, leave a comment what you would want to see, and I said I was going to do clear. I was thinking about doing Amnesia. Only problem is, I'm a little stuck on the first game, and I haven't still beaten it yet either because I don't know what to do. I put myself in a bad spot on a bad save, so I got nothing. So, I'm stuck there. Um, let me know. Just let me know your thoughts on Amnesia, like if uh, if it's record worthy or not. Um, what's a, what would be another thing you guys would? I, I hate dying. 
But what's another thing you guys would want to see? Uh, I'm thinking... Okay. So, recently I have bought Save the World on Fortnite. Now, I know what some of you are thinking. Why would you just... Why would you want to record more Fortnite? I'm not going to unless you guys want me to. Because Save the World is big. And I mean big. Like half a year's worth of work from what I've been told. And... It's very grindy, meaning like it's kind of like Skyrim, except you don't have multiple quests. You got one to work with, unless you feel like getting some V-Bucks, which I do sometimes. But... Like... It's... Kind of different than Battle Royale. Still same skins. Same third person, just with abilities. And can actually build and can hold more materials and everything. Anyways, short and simple of that is Save the World's better. Let me know if you want to see that in the comments. Um, what's another thing? I know you're not thinking... There, there's more games I'm going to plan on recording in the future. I just don't have some proper tech yet because I'm still stuck on Windows XP and I can already feel you judging me um PS3 let me go to the PS3 I don't have a capture card yet but I will I when I start to work somewhere and get some money I'm gonna try to save for a capture card get that going start uploading to my channel with that stuff. Now, I know what some of you are thinking. Why would you downgrade yourself to PS3? Because there are certain games on there that I would like to record for the channel, but I can't because I don't have tech. But there's also another way to... No, actually no, there isn't. Maybe, I don't know. That's an idea I have, but I'm not going to leak anything about it. It's just going to be another experiment. Anyways. That's probably it for this video. If you liked it, even though I just died a bunch of times. If you liked it, then leave a like. If you have any ideas you want to share, leave a comment. And don't forget to share to friends who are interested in this type of thing. And if you... Obviously, enjoy if you guys have been enjoying these videos, don't forget to subscribe, even though most of my viewers are subscribed. I'm talking about you non-subscribers. I don't know what you're doing if you're not subscribed. Uh, <laughs> but just please, just, just please, if you enjoyed everything, thank you. If you've been supporting me this entire time, again, thank you. And I will 